friends today we are going to have a repeat session of my mother at 66 uh, and uh, this poetry uh, was written by Kamla Das the writer of this poetry is Kamla Das and you should remember this thing uh, this poetry uh, is written by a daughter like from the heart of daughter for her mother and uh, here she is more worried about her uh, imminent death उसको लगता है कि उसकी मदर बहुत ही ओल्ड हो गई हैं बहुत ही कलरलेस हो गया उनका चेहरा उनकी एनर्जी जो है बहुत ही लो गई है और वो अपनी मदर को ऑब्जर्व करते हुए बहुत ही चिंता में है कि शायद वो अपनी मदर से दोबारा ना मिल पाए और वो ये पोएट्री अपनी मदर के लिए लिखती है ड्राइविंग फ्रॉम माय पेरेंट्स होम टू कोचीन लास्ट फ्राइडे मॉर्निंग आई सॉ माय मदर बिसाइड मी वो बहुत ध्यान से अपनी मदर को देखती है और वो कोचीन एयरपोर्ट जा रही है वापस अपने घर जा रही है अपनी मम्मी के घर से अपनी मदर के घर से एज शी स्टेज अवे फ्राम हर पेरेंट्स मे बी बिकॉज ऑफ मैरिज वर्क और स्टडी वट एवर इट इज़ इट इज़ नॉट मैंशन बट शी इज़ नॉट स्टेइंग विद हर मदर एंड शी इज़ गोइंग बैक एंड इट्स फ्राइडे मॉर्निंग and uh, she saw her mother who was just beside her very close to her uh, those open mouth her face asian like that of a corpse and realized released realized with pain here uh, what you can see jo mother ka face hai wo डोज uh, जैसे हम लोग बड़े लोग जब सो रहे होते हैं या हम भी कभी सो रहे होते हैं तो हमारा मुंह खुला रह जाता है बट ज़्यादातर बड़े लोग जो हैं अपना मुंह खोल कर सोते हैं क्योंकि शायद उन्हें ब्रीदिंग में प्रॉब्लम होती है बिकॉज ऑफ द एज इशू तो द मदर हु इज़ जस्ट बिसाइड हर इज डोजिंग शी इज़ स्लीपिंग विद ओपन माउथ हर फेस एशियन लाइक दैट ऑफ अ कॉप्स और उसकी मदर का चेहरा जो है बिल्कुल लाइफलेस है डल है Uh, just like a uh, human dead body corpse ka meaning hai human dead body and she realized uh, with pain and poet is in pain because she is worried about her mother because she is uh, sleeping open mouth with dull face just like a dead body and she is worried about her mother that she was an as old as she looked but soon put that thought away and looked out at young trees printing the merry children spilling out of their homes but after the airport security check standing a few yards now she is moving towards airport she is in a car with her mother and she is looking at her mother and she realized that mother has grown old and uh, her face is uh, not that beautiful not that bright as it used to be because of the age and just to put this thought away from her mind ki usko mann mein jo thought aa raha tha ki uski mother ka chehra ek dead body ki tarah hai asian ki tarah hai ash ki tarah hai lifeless hai aur is thought ko dur karne ke liye जो है वो बाहर देखने लगती है और बाहर उसको कौन दिखता है यंग चिल्ड्रन यंग इज लाइक द बिगनिंग ऑफ लाइफ एंड द आइडिया दैट द मदर वाज बिकमिंग ओल्ड एंड वीक वाज रियली डिप्रेसिंग फॉर हर एंड जस्ट टू गेट दिस थॉट अवे शी इज जस्ट ट्राइंग टू डाइवर्ट हर माइंड and she started looking out and she is looking at the young children so young is like beginning of life young trees printing i'm sorry not children young trees printing means jo zindagi ki shuruaat hai wo ya fir trees jo hai wo life giving hi hote hain to she is watching those trees trees sprinting so trees are actually not sprinting the car is moving but here because car is moving it seems that trees are sprinting like they are running with short steps um, just she wants to tell that uh, like uh, that uh, there is more enthusiasm and more life outside the car than inside the car the merry children spilling out of their homes but after the airport security check standing a few yards और uh, वो देखती है कि बच्चे जो हैं दे आर स्पिलिंग दैट डजेंट मीन दैट दे आर स्पिलिंग एक्चुअली दे आर रनिंग फ्री दे आर एन्जॉइंग एंड दे आर कमिंग आउट ऑफ देयर होम्स 
this reminded her of her own childhood and uh, she uh, she has reached the airport security check and that is just a few yards away and she is just few yards away from it and she is looking at those children outside going away um, her voice cannot reach her mother and that's uh, that is what is highlighted like standing a few yards whatever she wants to say to her mother whatever she is feeling she don't want to express that feeling to her mother she is just observing her mother and um, she has to leave her mother and she is leaving her mother and that's the reason she has gone to the airport and this is what is highlighted in this part away i looked again at her wan pale as a late winter's moon and felt that old familiar ache aur phir wo wapas apni mother ki taraf dekhti hai uske कलरलेस चेहरे को देखती है पेल चेहरे को देखती है जो कि वीक हो गया है एंड शी इज़ कंपेयरिंग दैट वीक फेस विद लेट विंटर्स मून आप देखते हैं ना कि विंटर्स में सब चीज़ें बहुत ही ज़्यादा डिप्रेसिंग होती हैं बहुत ही ज़्यादा लो एनर्जी की होती है और स्लो डाउन होता है और जो मून भी है वो इतना ब्राइट नहीं दिखता है ड्यू टू स्मॉग एंड फॉग जो वो डल लुक देता है तो दैट्स द रीज़न शी इज़ कंपेयरिंग हर मदर्स फेस विद दैट लेट विंटर्स मून एंड फेल्ट दैट ओल्ड और वो चेहरे उस चेहरे को देखने के बाद फिर उसको उस वो पुराना दर्द लाइक जब हम छोटे होते हैं तो हमें अपने सबसे ज़्यादा जो दुख होता है अपने पेरेंट्स से बिछड़ने का होता है कि हम कभी मार्केट जाते हैं या कहीं पे भी ऐसे मूव कर रहे होते हैं अगर हमारी मम्मी या पापा का हाथ जो है हमारे हाथ से छूट जाता है तो हम हमें डर लगता है कि कहीं हम गुम हो जाएंगे और मम्मी से हम बिछड़ जाएंगे सो दैट ओल्ड फैमिलियर एक चीज़ फेसिंग फेल्ट अर्लियर ऑल्सो दैट नेचुरल फियर दैट पेन दैट फियर माई चाइल्ड हुड फियर शी इज़ अगैन टॉकिंग अबाउट हर चाइल्ड हुड यर माई चाइल्ड हुड फियर ऑफ लूजिंग पेरेंट्स बट ऑल आई सेड वॉज सी यू सोन अम्मा बट उसने ये जो फीलिंग जो उसके अंदर आ रही थी अपनी मदर को देखकर उसने ये फीलिंग अपनी मदर को एक्सप्रेस नहीं की अपनी मदर को बोला सी यू सून अम्मा गिविंग एन अश्योरेंस टू हर ओन सेल्फ लाइक शी वॉन्ट्स टू एश्योर हर सेल्फ दैट शी इज़ गोइंग टू सी हर अम्मा अगैन उसको ऐसा नहीं लगता कि आ, उसको लग रहा है कि मम्मी ही मुझसे बिछड़ जाएंगी बट वो ये चीज़ शो नहीं करना चाहती अपनी डॉटर को All I did was smile, smile and smile. और उसने क्या किया अपनी मदर को देख कर सिर्फ स्माइल 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 एंड दैट स्माइल इज फेक स्माइल एक्चुअली शी इज नॉट हैप्पी बट शी वॉन्ट्स टू री एश्योर हर सेल्फ एंड टू हर मदर दैट ऑल इज़ गुड एंड दे आर गोइंग टू मीट सून एंड शी इज़ रिपीटिंग दीज वर्ड्स स्माइल टू एम्फसाइज Uh, on something that uh, but ultimately this smile is fake so let's quickly revise um, the main points to remember in this poetry like it is uh, based on the theme advancing age and the fear of loss of sep- and separation and the main points to remember are the poet was traveling in a car along with her mother to the kochi airport next point she compares the asian face of her mother to a dead body uh, suddenly realizes that her mother has grown old and will finally die leaving her in this world this thought is painful to her so to divert her mind she looks out of the window of car she sees the young trees running and the happy children coming out of their home they are representatives um, representatives of youth energy life and are in contrast to the pale worn out face of her mother who is sleeping beside her the dull face of her mother reminds her of the late winter's moon and troubles her once again of losing her mother at last she says goodbye to the, her mother with a smile and without disclosing her feelings and fear of separation here uh, let's discuss about the figures of speech now uh, simile her face asian like that of a corpse as a late winter's moon are two similes used in the poetry simile uh, you can easily figure out i as and like 
then is its a repetition repetition smile and smile and smile and one uh, more sometimes they ask you that is thought away thought away it's repeated twice so that also uh, you can mention in the whole poetry if they ask you some uh, poetic devices then thought away thought away repetition again then contrast old mother in the car has been contrasted uh, with young trees running and happy children coming out of their homes to the sadness of the poet on realizing and there are few extracts which you can practice uh, at uh, home and again a repetition quick repetition and recall like simile uh, repetition a rhyming scheme free words there is no specific rhyming scheme then symbols and images personification is there metaphor merry children spilling and uh, uh, sp uh, spilling out of their homes so these are metaphors so you try to remember these and uh, here are few extracts which you can practice at home uh, and uh, this will help you to uh, revise the poetry thoroughly and uh, uh, in the examination four marks of extract comes from poetry and uh, repetitively these literary devices are coming because lots of children they are confused with the rhyming scheme and the literary devices so I have added it uh, uh, twice. So that's all for this session of my mother at 66. I hope I have cleared all your uh, 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 points uh, when it comes to this poetry my mother at 66. Please try to remember it and try to uh, finish this exercise uh, in your fair notebook and if uh, certain extracts you have already done try to skip those those who, those uh, extracts or questions which you haven't done in the previous session try to pin down those answers in your fair notebook thank you so much children